you guys, so I'm finally coming to you with another video, and originally it was supposed to be um, a tutorial for the eye look that I'm wearing, which is using my Too Faced um, Naked Eye Palette, but so I'm not used to this camera, and I haven't figured out a way to set it up and do a makeup at the same time, but it was using this palette, and I actually really like the outcome, and it sucks that I didn't get it on film, um, but lately I've been practicing smoky eye looks because I have a wedding coming up at the end of the May, at the end of the May, I have a wedding coming up um, at the end of the month, and I want to do like a really dark smoky eye, so I really like the way this came out, I think the only thing I would change was I would darken up um, like my outer corner or whatever, I also have a video that I've been wanting to do, but for some reason I always put it off, but it is showing you guys my three favorite hair products, now, I almost dropped one, now, if you follow my videos, you would know that I did like a huge hair products haul because I'm just trying to keep my hair healthy as possible and, you know, try to find like the perfect products for it. And I finally have three that I just, as of now, like I feel like I have to use for the rest of my life. Um, but, you know, it's a little too exaggerating, but you know what I mean. And they are, I guess I can start off with one. Well, I'll start off with this one. And this is the Macadamia Oil Nourishing Leave-In Cream. But you just take a pea-sized amount, rub it into your palms, and then just put it at the ends of your hair. I tried one time using more than a pea size, and it just did not work out. It just makes your hair feel thick, and I just didn't like the way it made my hair feel. So ever since then, I stick to my pea-sized amount, and I love that product. It makes my hair feel so soft, and, like, I just love it. The next two products are from the same line. They are the John Fritter Frizzies. This one is the Rehydrate Intensive Deep Conditioner. And then this one is the Daily Nourishing Nourishment. Daily Nourishment Leave-In Conditioning Spray. And this one, you just use it after you shampoo in the shower. You use it as a regular conditioner, leave it on for a minute, and then just, you know, rinse it off. And it just makes your hair feel so soft. Like, all of these products I just absolutely love. And the, these two I never use on the same day just because I feel like they're the same thing. Just this one is, like, in a spray form and this is in a conditioner form. So I alternate I alternate all these products. With this one, you just spray on damp hair. And I usually just, like, when I get out of the shower, the first thing I do is my makeup. So I take my towel off. I spray this all over my hair, put my hair back in a ponytail or just a bun or whatever, do my makeup, and then, you know, I'll style my hair as normal. But I just love this. I even love to use this product on days. Days that I'm not going to do my hair, but I'll wash it, you know, whatever is normal. And then I spray this all over, and then I just put my hair in a ponytail or I put my hair in a braid and just kind of, like, give my hair the day off and let it soak up, like, all this goodness. Um... So yeah, these are like my favorite products, and I think these are my favorite because when I use these products, I can just totally feel the difference in my hair. Like, I have other conditioners and stuff, like, you see that up there? Those are all my current hair products and other products too, but like I have a lot of other conditioners and stuff and leave-in sprays that I use, and, but these to me are just my favorite because when I use these products I can feel the difference in my hair and it's like I love that I can feel the softness I can feel how it just like feels so healthy and that is like the goal with my hair because I had it super long um, before I cut it but it wasn't healthy like I had split ends and stuff like that I had to like chop it all off like now my shortest layer is like up to there which is not super short but short compared to like how long my hair was um so yeah I've been just babying my hair, just, you know, using as many things, of course, as you see, I've been trying to find, like, the perfect products, and I finally have my favorite ones. I mean, I like the other products I have, um, because I feel, you know, they do bring something to the table as far as, you know, my hair goes, but these are just my favorite, and they also smell so good. I think I'm, like, in love with the John Frieda collection, or the line, whatever you want to call it. Because I also have the Luxurious Volume Shampoo and Conditioner, and I love it. It smells so good. It doesn't do so much for the volumizing, but it just smells so good. So I think I'm, like, in love with John Frieda. And then, also, as soon as I finish all the hair, well, not all of them, but most of the hair products I have up there, I plan to buy the entire line 
for the macadamia oil line or natural oil line because I just would love to see what that does to my hair but I do have a lot of stuff to finish up there so I didn't want to like add more to the table um, but yeah that's pretty much it I just wanted to get this video up because I've been putting it off like I've seriously planned to do that video with my three favorite products for like the past week and I just haven't done it and then since I was going to film a tutorial, I said I might as well film that video and then try to figure out a way to do tutorials because it really sucks to not be able to do them. Um, so yeah, if you guys have any questions on any of these products, just let me know. Oh, and then also, if you guys don't follow me on Tumblr, follow me on Tumblr because on Tumblr, I'll post like, not daily, but I should start doing it daily, um, like daily photos of products I've used on my hair that day. So like today, for instance, it would be the shampoo and conditioner for this line, and then the macadamia oil, because that's what I've used on my hair, on my hair, that's what I've used on my hair today, and then of course there's like heat tamer and stuff like that, but that's, you know, I don't picture that um, in the picture, but I do post that on my Tumblr, and then I also post like just, you know, what nail color I'm wearing and stuff like that, so you can check that out if you want. But that pretty much completes this video. Again, if you guys have any questions, let me know. And I will talk to you guys later. Bye.